Yo guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video, we're going to be reviewing the new Renato Sanchez uh, SPC for foot 17 in the foot birthday SPC's pile. But before we get started, if you're new to the channel, please subscribe We're four subs away from getting 100. Uh, in the last video, we had a lot of support. I really thank you guys. But let's get straight into this review. Obviously, uh, Leo, Leo, I think Leo. I don't know. I don't know what this called. I don't know. I, how do you say that? Leo, Lord, I don't know, man. Anyways, he's Portuguese. So Bruno, Ronaldo, great links there. Uh, Portuguese, obviously. Uh, 88 pace is fantastic as a center mid, a box box maybe. Yeah. You so a box to box, 88 pace, 85 shooting, 86 passing, 90 dribbling is fantastic, and 83 defending with 90 physicality, which is nuts. That's his face stats, right? Four star school moves, high high work rate, five nine. Again, interceptions. He might he might have good. He doesn't have good interceptions, which is expected when you're like five seven or five nine. Um, so yeah, he's gonna be your box to box, help you create those attacking chances moving forward, and also uh, come back on defense when you need him the most. Uh, yeah, obviously with that pace, put the shadow on him, 98 pace. He's going up and down the pitch as fast as as you want him to go. Finishing is not really the greatest, but he does have a shot power. Long shots is good as well. So maybe a few long shots could go in with this card. Uh, but I wouldn't I wouldn't put money on him scoring that many goals for you. Maybe just assisting and just creating the chances for your cam or your striker to just finish it off. Um, balance and agility is really good as a center mid. I guess box to box. Maybe some people want him CDM. I don't know. It's all up to opinion. For me, I'll play him as a like an attacking CDM and have one really defensive center uh, CDM. Maybe like Vidal or I don't know. Just a really you want to partner this guy up with a very very defensive CDM to have a very solid midfield. Obviously, the defending stats are not the greatest. Side tackling is a bit low, but side tackling is not a thing in this game like that much stamina is fantastic so yeah he's gonna run up and down the pitch for you as much as possible he has a few traits it's three spcs at 85 and 86 and an 87 rate spc so this card is gonna be expensive but as expected like his road to the final and his team of the week are going for millions uh at a certain point so it is expect expected for this card to be this expensive you get a rare electron player pack um you get a premium gold players pack and you get a prime electron players pack i think this card is a dub he is meta and he's gonna be that one player, key player to create chances and help you attack in the in the forward three in the last third and create a lot of goals. Tell me tell me what you guys think. Is this SPC overpriced? Uh, I think it's worth it. Uh, that's my decision. I think it's very worth it. And let me know in the comments below. Yeah. Uh, do you guys think it's worth it? What do you guys think about this card? Should his rating be higher? Maybe 88, 89. I think 88, 89 would have been nice. But yeah, that's my review on this new Renato Sanchez card. Uh, if you're new to the channel, as I said earlier, please subscribe. Roll to 100 sub. And if you enjoyed this video or if you agreed with me, leave a like down below. And peace. Come take a ride, we can go we your life I wanna see you in slow motion Come stay the night, we can stay till it's bright In the morning, got the top open Come take a ride, we can go we your life I wanna see you in slow motion